Damn, no good. Stupid thing won't even budge. Try forcing it. Try to force it unless it's pointless. We need to find another way out. Hmm. Like this one. Like this one. Yeah. You ready? I'm going to put in the key in. You don't need to ask me every time you're going to do something. Just tear it up. Right, right, I know. Right, here goes. Stop talking and do it. I think Junpei did the same thing half the time. Yeah, Junpei did. But <laughs> it, in his case, he had a lot more support <laughs> instead of a lot of sass. Yeah, that's true. You only have her so far. Open this panel. You make me open it, really? <laughs> Once you decide the novel section of this game will begin. For more face from the control for the novel section, check help, blah, blah. Are you ready? Just do it. All right, all right. Rest received. Here we go. Three, two, one, and pushing. The door is open. Yeah, he's uh, the main character here. Go as slow as possible. Yeah, he sounds like an asshole. <laughs> oh, it opened a hatch in the ceiling? What? Why does it ever have ceiling hats? No. He escaped. Maybe it's not a seal. Maybe it's not an elevator. Oh. Ho, 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 ho. All right, it's open. Now let's get the hell out of here. What? What's wrong? Oh yeah, gets a little high for you, huh? I say it's at least six feet, maybe more. <laughs> All right then. Climb up on my shoulders. Your shoulders. Your shoulders. Yeah, that's right. Why, something wrong? What's wrong, Black? What's that supposed to mean? What do you think I'm gonna do? Oh, come on. I'm just trying to be rational here. No ulterior motive. Hand to God. Not like I'm hoping to get my face sent between the girl's bare thighs or. Oh, my God. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> Bastard. I, I was just kidding. <laughs> right, look, I'm just trying to get us out. I think she's wearing a skirt too, if I remember correctly. Oh, is she wearing a skirt? I think she's wearing I a skirt. I thought it was short yeah. shorts. I think it is. She could be something wearing shorts underneath, but I think it's a skirt. Uh, you got any brilliant ideas that can don't involve your thighs? Miss thighs? I mean, girl? Fine. Fine. On your knees. On your knees. What? You're you look tall for me just to jump on your shoulders. Jump up on your shoulders. I'm certainly not going to give you the satisfaction of making me climb. So kneel. Oh, okay. There. Ready, mistress? I mean, uh, <clears throat> girl? <laughs> Ready? Bring it on. Thanks. A little step up is just what I needed. What? Wait, what, what? are you going to do? Wait. Three. Go. Animation time. Maybe not. Oh, okay. There it is. Oh, there it goes. You can fly? What the hell? Give me your hand. Oh, uh, what the heck are I'm you? I'm not Superman, that's for sure. And I'm not Batman or Spider-Man or Aquaman or Merman or a Wolfman. I don't know if you can get away with this and I don't if know you try to do it today. I don't know if you can get away with this nowadays. Yeah, I think they just could do it because it's just a name thing. But nowadays, fuck, I don't know. Laws are weird, man. I mean, fucking people have been sued for less I'm for this kind of yeah. stuff. Or common or ramen. I'm not a caiman either, so you don't really need to worry about anything. My name is Fire. What? That's her name. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, no, Fire, she's a, like I said, a robot. she's got a weirdness with her, but what she is. Bye. Well, I guess you could are you our, are you our man. super quantum computer? <laughs> I don't actually don't remember why she says all this too, Just but it's the weirdness. On. One of these days, witch king. I think all of that's a reference, by the way. Which I, I, yeah, I believe all of that she said is a reference. It's a weirdly modeled thumb. Yeah. <laughs> Look, they had they had to do some basic stuff and modeling and all that, and it's fine. What the fuck kind of room is this? You move when go comedy. Ah oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not expecting it to be in blood. Yeah, it's still a little much. Sure doesn't look like an elevator shaft. Some kind of warehouse, maybe. Yeah, so, uh, right twist, here. we went in an elevator. Mm-hmm. We, we were in an elevator that doesn't elevate? Yeah. It wasn't yeah. going to go anywhere. Yeah, we were never going to fall. We never said it was going to fall. He was just screwing with us. So it would seem. Yes. <laughs> then why? Look. More people. And there are others. Like More people. Yeah. Look at that ragtag group of fucking near dwells. <laughs> yeah. 
a bunch of random people, definitely random, no relation to one another whatsoever here. Kid? Bracelets? Safe to assume they're trapped here too. And they're probably contestants. Participants, victims, one and two. All of them. Let's go say hi! How'd you do there? One of them's probably the villain. Yeah. You also learned we're kind of a bit, I guess, positive. Look at that outfit. What the actual fuck is that yeah. outfit? Yeah, don't worry about it. Hey, hey there. And you guys know what the hell's going on here? No, we don't. Is also, that fucking Cleopatra? Us. <laughs> is that our mummy? Uh, a our mummy? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, with this weird outfit. What is this even? But yeah. She's trying to show the girls you off, too. I guess. They grabbed you too, huh? Grab? That's a memory of, I guess, when we first our got memory. Here. Yeah. This man looks oh, yeah. obviously like he did something. He he, he's just... hiding something, man. Or he got pulled after he was going to work, and he's like, fuck this, I'm tired. I'm... <laughs> Look, I was I would expect to go to work and have a hell of a day, and I'm going here having a hell of a day. Ain't much difference, but still. I went to start the engine, then there was this white smoke. I think we all shared that particular experience. Yeah. The smoke seems to be some kind of general anesthetic. When I woke up, I was in one of these elevators. Elevators. It's just, I mean, I guess he's saying, like, not what is an elevator, but rather this quote-unquote elevator, which is an elevator, I think he's saying. All five of you were in one elevator? No, Mr. Dio and I were in the same elevator, but... Mr. Dio. Look at this kid's hat. What is this? Look at this fucking actual child. <laughs> actual child from some fantasy world. Look at this. <laughs> What's that new? Uh, what's that new anime that just played out? That just went aired. That has the girl that makes the ro the drilling robots. Oh my god! Looks like he belongs in that series. Oh my god, yeah. Absolutely, some sort of uh, underground world he lives in. That would be me. This is Dio. This little guy here is Quark. Quark. Nice to meet you, Mister. Uh, right. Nice to meet you too. So, what about the rest of you? Tent the OG Alice and Luna all woke up in different elevators. Uh, that's the other three. We don't know exactly who, but the names of them. Yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong. No, you've got it right. So you be Ten Oji then, right, sir? Yep. Yep. And Alice is me. There you go. So yeah, uh, just as a quick little reference point, uh, Alice all ice. Yeah, all ice. Yeah. So <sighs> it's yeah. Uh, significant or not, was they kind of just had fun with it, and yeah, this is the character now. They did pick up a hitchhiker. Yep. He's Luna. Hello. It's very nice to meet you. Uh, hey. Nice to meet you too. What are you nervous about? And you are. I mean, there is a chick with her tits all out next to yeah. her. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of weird. And we have this circus boy, I think. Literal circus boy. Yeah. This bundle of last is five. Good to meet you all, I guess. Say that again. We can't help it because you create a positive energy and it doesn't rub it and Phi is not one for it. <laughs> and this malnourished harpy is Phi. Better. <laughs> yeah, so we just have this sass back and forth. That's a consistent thing, more or less. Yeah, it seems like it. Yeah. Um are you two Are you two? Ah, not likely. That elevator was the first time we'd seen each other. I think. You think? Uh, never mind. Forget I said anything. Don't worry about it. This whole mystery is insane nonsense. We listen to a talking bunny. Don't worry about how she know she knew my name. Mm. Some weird shit's going on. Yeah, let's talk about ramen and common, and then Batman got sued. It was weird. That's the truth. Uh, they, uh, there was a mouse with a cease and desist. Yeah. Came up right to us and then left immediately. Huh? Oh, yeah, sir. Hmm. And yours. Bye, right? Bye. Now let me have a look. Be uh, pair. I thought. What? Quark. You and Quark? Dio show them your bracelets. And now we'll learn about the bracelets a bit more. They both say pair and have a number three. Just like fine eye. No, oh, wait. The color's different. Ours are red. And yours are blue. Sharp eye there. Thanks. <laughs> no hint of sarcasm. 
What about you, uh, uh, sir? Then me Oji, right? Show him yours too, ladies. Three solo and three solo. Three solo. Three solo. A red, blue, and green? They're different. You've all got threes, but your bracelet says solo. Right. Right. I like how you just. I, I, fucking Sigma can't help but state the obvious half the time. You figure it out. So then. you mentioned that this one follows a very yeah, similar rule set of the Nonary games, the numbers and stuff, but they do it differently. There it's is. Part of that. Yes, this is going to be a little part of that. We we'll probably go over the rules soon, I think. If not, we're we'll probably after the first, I guess, choice as the rules get established. Sigma and I are the red pair. Dio and Quark are the blue pair. Each pair got put in the same elevator. Mm -hmm. But Tenmyoji, Alice, and Luna were all solos. So... So they got put in their own separate elevators? Yeah, that's great and all, but what do pair and solo mean? I got the foggiest idea. No clue. Yeah, so this is it'll follow a similar style where you you know like make decisions and your numbers matter, but it won't like the the pair and solo are kind of more important upon choices more than else in sense. It's weird. Yeah. Anybody but they do explain that I believe soon enough. Maybe it has something to do with the game. Game? Oh yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Also back uh we call it flashbacks are another common thing again too. The back. Because again, sometimes you play this game after coming back a long time about a different path where you took and then yeah. you go, oh wait, yeah, that did happen, this one. So it's all important to kind of remember. I do not like that thing's <laughs> fucking voice. I just didn't, I don't know what the right kind of style it is. I'd say Tiny Tina is the closest thing I can think of. Yes. But yeah, it's that it kind of closest and I do not like that. Yeah. It's this sort of loud, bombastic, almost kid-like feature to them. He said something about the elevator falling. Yeah, they were gonna fall. It does explain that after they'd escaped from their own elevators, they'd gone through the warehousey room we were in and tested the doors. Unfortunately, it turned out they were all set tight and impossible to open. They had been about to try and open this door, the one with the nine on it, when Fi and I appeared. Nine, it's back. So, any chance this one will open? think we'd have done it last if there was there's some sort of i don't know machine off the left here but we'll give it a shot why don't you all right smike so i guess i will oh it didn't work why no one tell me that <laughs> looks like force probably isn't gonna work here either try force i am not working damn well i didn't really think that would work anyways i don't think you'll be able to force that door with anything short of a tank hmm and we got tank well, all right, how about these three doors over there? I told you already. <laughs> you had the uh in it. You're right. <laughs> Not even in the dialogue. They just, he added it. The kid was like, yeah, okay, I, I got it. I don't think this is even a kid. This might just be a, like, what is it? An old be? man. Old man or old woman or something like that. They didn't mention is. The, the 80 to approach 18. Mm. You sure about that? Okay. Are there any other ways out? No, unfortunately. Not that we've found anyway. Great. Well, there is one thing I'm a little curious about. And that is? I was the first to escape. That means I know who was in which elevator. Oh. I think there's only six then so far? We have... I guess so. Yeah. I watched all of you come out after all. <laughs> and? Well, I was in the one-third from the right. And only one of us is telling the truth, but two of them are lying. Tenmyoji was the second out. Your elevator was okay, second Alice. left, I think. Mm, good memory. Yeah, that's where I was. The so Tenmyoji was, was here. Luna. You okay. Luna. Right Luna. Elevator, didn't you? Yes, that's the one. Dio and Quark oh, well, were okay. next. You came out of the elevator next to Luna's, right? Yeah. So here. We did. So that and makes finally, five. The two of you were trapped in mm -hmm. the third elevator from the left. Here. Yes. Right then. Yes. No one has come that out makes of the seven. Most so we're still waiting on someone. Are you, or some people. Are you saying there's still someone in there? I can't say for certain, but it does seem strange. Maybe we should go take a look. Yeah, good idea. Someone in there? Knock, knock. 
Make some noise. Holler at your boys. Anyone there? Nothing. Nothing. Hey, look at this. Ambidex. I mean, all of them said Ambidex room, though. Did they all say Ambidex room? Card? Yeah, they all had this placard on it. That's some sort of card reader, but they're referring to this. Maybe it unlocks it or something. Something. There's one next to each door. <laughs> what do you think Ambidex room is supposed to mean? Well, given the title of this yeah, exactly game, he said was Ambidex edition. I'm saying it's something <laughs> very important. It something to do with the game that Zero was talking about. Oh, the Nonori game Ambidex edition. That sounds like some fighting game, like add on to. It does. It sounds like version <laughs> revision three or some shit. Yeah, revision three Ultra Sigma. At least they're not fucking Undernight titles. <laughs> Undernight in birth ex ex late tier or whatever the fuck that's called. Okay. <laughs> people people have been uh, abbreviating it to Uniclear. Uniclear. Wonderful. Yeah, fuck. I mean, yeah. Is that? Is that really just the first letter of each word, or was that actually just a like a as close to... as you could get with okay. that? Okay, <laughs> the rest of us dug through a pocket as well, but it was pretty obvious that deal was right. My own were completely empty. There wasn't even any lint in the crashes. Pretty impressive. Maybe there's no one in there. Maybe there's no one in there. No, there's gotta well, be. What makes you so sure? Huh? Well, I, I don't know. <laughs> this old memory of mine, you know. Oh, look at that! It opened. There it is. He's still he's kind of happy. They're both kind of happy, actually. Look at it. Not really, not really a surprised face, you know? Yeah. Opening. And did what there they could, I guess. Someone in there. That voice. That voice is also familiar. Yeah. I know 3DS. There, pro there was probably a... Uh... Yeah, only so many. Welcome to the bit of weird, by the way. Again, I'm a bit more weird than Fi on more top of this. More weird than normal. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Who the hell? And Clover. Clover? Oh, yeah, I was seeing that. Clover was supposed to be the re returning character. Yeah, okay. she's a returning character. Clover, wake up. So this has to be fucking the chick they hitch that hitchhiked with them at the end of the first one. Yeah, it's a good chance of that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. What's going on here? Do these two know each other? Are what they like, you know, her? a thing? Can I get him? What did you do to her? She was like that when I woke up. Masked man. I really wouldn't worry though. That's a fucking robot. That is not a mask. <laughs> Seems to be alright. Right. Breathing is steady. I believe she's only sleeping. Then she hasn't woken up. I'm not gonna, not gonna bring attention to that first. We're just gonna. Uh, kidnapped? I'm begging your pardon, but I'm afraid I don't understand what you mean. Where are we? Yeah. Look at this Where weirdness. <laughs> Look at this not robot. <laughs> What wearing weird robes and stuff. Well, hold on. Have you tell us who you are first? You leap out of the box just like some kind of robot carrying on kind of skill. You only got your word that you didn't make her that way. I think you owe us an explanation, pal. I'm... As he like points at him and like nudges him. What's he gonna do to this guy? You know? Yeah. We did look kind of decently built, Sigma. But I mean, still. He looks like a. He looks robot, like. Though. This looks like it's supposed to be the robot prototype that Phi ends up becoming. <laughs> This was, uh, this was the original one. This was the original who, one. Who am I? What? I don't remember. I mean, let's be honest. That's of course he has amnesia. Yeah. I don't remember anything. No idea where I am, who I am, what day it is. Mm -hmm. If you happen to know any of those things, I would very much appreciate if you shared that information. Also, my social security number. That'd be very helpful. And my credit card, my PIN number, anything in value, in fact. There's a lot of uh, purchases I must make soon. Oh, yeah, very original. The amnesiac routine. Please, how are we supposed to take you seriously All right. wearing this? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that's the most startling thing about him right now. It's this stuff he's wearing or not wearing in his. We can't even see your face. You gonna tell someone forced you into that thing? I assume so. It seems the most reasonable explanation. When I woke up, I was wearing this armor, armor. I yeah. suppose you could call it. You look pretty calm for a man who doesn't know who he is. Look? That's an odd choice of words. I'm I guess. Wearing a mask. 
How would you know how I look? You know More of a turn of phrase, but yeah. <laughs> And Clover's coming too. She's waking up. Clover, are you okay? Come on, talk to me. It's a little weird. This 3D model, not greatest, but okay looking on this. Look at this nothing yeah. JPEG floor. It might as well <laughs> have been a picture. <laughs> yeah, they worked with it to make it cheaper, I think. But like, yeah, it's a little. I kind of do miss the pixel art styles and all that earlier than the first one. Uh where are we? So they know each other, obviously. Mm hmm And yeah, they probably are the... It's Clover, probably, and the Hitchhiker. Once Clover had woken up, Alice uh, explained everything we knew so far. She listened silently until Alice mentioned Zero in the Nonary game. And then her eyes went wide. What? Looks a little happy there, actually. I don't think she's surprised. A little they, bit, yeah. They really didn't get those surprise faces down really well, I think. I didn't know from working. Also, look at this outfit. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck they're doing with that. Yeah, I'll have to show you that. We might watch a video later. It probably won't be recorded or not. Of the mini game they had to uh, promote this game, by the way. No. Oh, fine. No. Yeah, we'll look that up later if we can. No, that can't. The blood drained from her face and she wrapped her arms tightly around herself. What does she know? As Alice continued to console Clover, the rest of us turned to question the mysterious man in the mask. The man in the mask, the, the wrestler. What will lose your memory? When? I suppose. I mean, that would be a difficult question. Yeah, I mean, everything here is a difficult question of what's going on. So, I feel like him having amnesia isn't that weird. Let's be honest here. I think the weirdest thing is the suit, and we're not gonna bring attention to that. Nothing. Well, they, I guess they did, but we asked everything we could think of: birthday, address, occupation, family, childhood. But all he did was shake his head. I think he has generalized amnesia. Generalized, even. It's a type of memory loss. Oh, yeah, hmm. you know, you just lose everything. Yep. Like language, social common sense, memorized facts, abilities they've learned. Hmm. But anything that has to do with uh, themselves is just lost. I don't know if this is necessarily lost. I think it was forced away somehow, but sure. Or oh, never had it. Yeah. That's one of the two options. Most research suggests that it's mainly psychological, not physiological. But in very rare instances, it has been shown to result from severe head trauma. Hmm. He knows a lot. She does seem to know a lot. You a college student? Yeah. Hmm. He does look malnourished. Maybe I she had does look malnourished. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a robot. I have no heart. He's making a laughing sort of noise. But his expression didn't change. With the mask on, there was no way we could tell if he was spotting or not. But his voice sure didn't make it sound like he was. To be fair, everyone else is so shocked and surprised, but smiling all half the time anyways. So, I don't know. Bullshit. Guy's obviously full of it. Don't tell me you're actually buying this. <laughs> Again, I mean, we're kind of in an area where we can't say nothing as we are right now. He's up with agreed with awkward silence. I have a problem with people named Dio. <laughs> we didn't, it wasn't that we trusted the robot man, per se. <laughs> yeah, but Dio's kind of an ass looking at him. It seemed clearly he was in the same boat we were. There's a bracelet in his wrist, too. Those suspect me that his armor fit around the bracelet. In other words, the bracelet was attached to his arm, like ours, and not simply part of his suit. Can you... Can you tell that, really? Can you tell that? Yeah, it's kind of just there. Because it looks like it's embedded into his fucking arm. Yeah, it's... Yeah. It doesn't really sew an arm beneath it, you know? Yeah. And just like ours, his had a three on it. It said pear, but all the three and all the text was bright green. I closed, which is exactly the same. Yeah, so same thing paired up. Mm -hmm. How long had we been there? I hadn't entirely sick in the last taste of the sleep out of my head, and my brain felt foggy and cluttered. Had I been asleep for hours, days? There's no way to know. They take my favorite watch when they grabbed me and gave me the brace instead, and unless it happened to be three right now, it wasn't going to be very useful for all the telling time. With no windows in the warehouse, it was impossible to even guess what time of day or night it was. Time could have stopped, then we wouldn't have the first idea. Damn it! No dice. You really have to say damn it. Is that how you mm -hmm. say damn it? Is it the end silent? Is I think the, the end is silent. Weird. I still prefer two M's. Kind of makes sense. I don't know why. But, I mean, English, right? Who cares? Nonsense <laughs> happening all the time. Shut up, you snarky kid. 
Yeah, I just I just thought I could. There's a box you know. here. Maybe it's some sort of locking thing. Like the ones next like to the lock. Lock. <laughs> lock. I don't know. I don't think I want to jump into conclusions like that right now. All we know it says lock. <laughs> hey, what do you think that is? That graffiti what? over there. Graffiti? See, on the wall? Who did graffiti? Oh yes, that. I was wondering what that was. Oh yeah, just that, the blood. Eh, it's fine. Two milkmen go comedy. I'm not sure what that's supposed to mean. <laughs> Maybe it's saying that a pair of milkmen decided to become comedians. No, this kind of sounds like nonsense, though. I think it's somebody's it, way of yeah, 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 it does. Yeah. Huh? What? You heard me. You heard me. I, I did. I just, I don't. Like, I heard you physically, yes, but I don't think, like, understanding was exactly expressed through those words. It's an anagram. An anagram? Yeah. They tried a lot of names before they worked it down to Tella. Come on, seriously? You've never heard of an <laughs> You never heard of an anagram? It's a kind of um wordplay where you move the letters around to create something else. Right? Exactly. Mm. Watch. I'm gonna watch. Pick up a boot, five spelled out two sentences in the dust on the floor. Two milkman go comedy. And then Welcome to welcome my kingdom. To my kingdom. Ugh. Yeah. Ugh. By the way, anagrams are a thing that pops up more often than once. So. Oh, here? There yeah. There's more of those. I think they used a couple of them in the first game. I think they might have. But yeah, there's more in this one, too. Yeah, that makes sense. Huh? Mm, exactly. I'm also glad people just do that off the top of the head. Like, what? It's like that? Those are the kind of people who like do crossword puzzles and word search like every day in the newspaper. Yeah, those are the people Seems you, like you kind of want to not get on their bad stuff. side. Yeah. Like they they get capable of doing things that I'm scared of. Right. Where are they? Pretty rude to invite somebody over and not even offer sure. them a drink. But you're assuming that Zero isn't one of us. <clears throat> Oh, Every no. Every reaction. <laughs> Clover should be like, fuck this, not again. Yeah, kind of. I have to kill people again? I mean... <laughs> See, that, that does seem very Tiny tina is though. Yeah, it does. Huh? Stop smiling. Over there. Stop a wooing. <laughs> Fido. You can't say what I'm about to say before I say it. Zero. I've got a plan, you know. I can't just tell you everything at once. Although, things <laughs> are starting to get exciting. <laughs> yeah, that, I still don't understand the whole bunny thing and Chinese bunny thing, too. I don't know exactly. I don't get that either. Yeah. Where are you, you little bastard? Whatever. Too scared to come out and face me like a man? Hold on. Are you an idiot? I'm a rabbit. I can auto it too. Nice. That's a rabbits? control? That is. A <laughs> uh, I might actually do that with the voice dialogue here a little bit. Here and there. Can I get it? So yeah, okay, if I click though, it automatically gets rid of auto. That's same. All right. That's not what I meant though. Let's see how delayed it is. Oh. It's not too bad. You meant you want to see the person who is controlling me? Oh. What yeah. the fuck? Weren't you listening to Fido? She's clever, you know. Caught him stupid, by the way. Yeah. And he didn't understand it, so that's pretty messed up. Zero's one of us? Yes. I guess that's one way to put it. Are you really sure? <laughs> Look at us just there. This is a big old room. Right. Where we can see our 3D models in action. Or well, not action, I guess. That looks in like such view. a fucking PS2 <laughs> shot I, I've ever seen. Yeah. He's saying um, that Zero must be controlled. How much we control him, right? Of course, which is why they told us in the first file. Yeah. And of course, the second part. Now, 
He doesn't know? I guess he doesn't know. He doesn't know? It doesn't know? It's a thing, I guess. Mm hmm. Physically, sir, but what does he? Wait. I feel like all of them are known voice actors. Known the game, Abidex Edition. They have to be. I'll probably look it up in a second. Super they fight sound time edition. Really, really. Uh similar yeah familiar stop smiling must be over yeah those <laughs> models are not great <laughs> yeah like it's so, i think it's like the first 3d stuff know. they might have ever done honestly enough which is still impressive in tone right sir be. but they really can't get those facial expressions the idle animations to work well with it related to the number nine nona can be used as a prefix as well or it means essentially the same thing mm. Therefore, it stands to things that we might have learned actually in the first game actually about no way game deals with the number nine in some way exactly. about it being the nine yeah yeah it was a big thing in the first game goal Game master game spinning over this. <laughs> of course you do. Now tell me, Fido, what number is on yours? A three. What about the rest of you? <laughs> They're all the same. We've all got threes. Exactly. I'm yeah, this voice too. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty sure all of them, yes, but. I don't think any of them are from the first game in terms of voices, though. I don't think they really had a voice in the first game. They had, um... Like, very minor things here and there. The PC version, they had, a uh, yeah. Quite a few of them. Hold yeah, on. Not too many. Let's do behind the voice you know act. Well, they're going through that. I can actually look up myself, too. But he's going over how we get the nines themselves right now. Yeah. So, how to increase your numbers to nine is what he's going over. Carrot, forget. He also, uh, Zero here is Pun Master. Disgusting. Yeah. The so same rules last time. You have nine seconds to exit the door and enter and stuff. Oh, hey, there would you look at that? Hmm? Sigma is a legendary topical uh, voice actor. There Troy you go. Baker. There you go. It's the same voice <laughs> <laughs> that he always does. Can't wait for that uh that NFT of his to come out and call people the N-word. Yeah, I see how that goes. Lapping. I think that's um rabbit in a language. Probably. Something. All you need to know is that anybody who tries to sneak out anybody with a big what the hell does that mean? Down in front. Sorry, I'll death. Um. Yes. Okay, so Fi's uh, voice like actor, Rabbit actress. Hmm. Uh, it's I guess from Persona Three. Oh, neat. I still play uh, Three. As well as uh. Never mind that. Rouge the Bat. You okay. What we need to know most. How do we get BP? Empedex room. Like you can always call it the AV room hmm. I think that's explained to you in the those, file. Uh, elevators? So how do we go about using them? How else do you use a room? You go in. <laughs> those hatches? And I guess she was Anna in the Fire Emblem games. Ah, okay. So I 
I could kind of hear it there. I like Anna had Luna. a lot of line, uh, voice lines anyways, though. Yeah. Luna is Laura Bailey. Hmm. Dio is Liam O'Brien. Okay. How do we get in then? Yeah, I can hear it. Ten OG is uh, Dave B. Mitchell. Thank you. I don't recognize his name. Who's his most uh, recent voice role? Yeah, we didn't have to find the car keys, or if he's talking about them. Then where are they? Oh, the current voice of Knuckles the Echidna from the recent Sonic stuff. Oh, okay. Okay. That's good. Chromatic doors. Chroma. As in Chrome? Oh, we gotta use Google to open him. <laughs> Make sure to put that ad block on so we don't get stopped. Oh, shoot, it's everywhere. Like said that. Why doesn't everybody press their buttons as well? Everybody, fuck no. off. Ben. The two digits on the left show hours, and the two on the right show minutes. Does that mean it's twelve ten in the morning? No. You dummy. Oh, the numbers are going down. It's going from ten. The clocks. What timers? So, that would mean this must be counting down to something, right? These are some fucking. <laughs> oh boy! What? Alice's voice actress has done some uh, Atlas work, oh. and uh, Catherine, and she is Maya in Persona 2: Innocent Sin, as well as Shoji from Devil Survivor uh, One, hmm. and she's. Uh, several characters from the dub of Digimon. Oh, okay. And she is a character named Yuki from the awful game of Chance at Arms. Okay. <laughs> Which I will show you later. That, oh, yeah. that is a trip. You have 